Okay, so this means it's recording. Mm -hmm. And when it stops, the red light goes away. It'll have like a big thing. message. Hey, you guys. I'm here today with my good friend Jade, and she has agreed to do the bird box challenge with me. So, what does that mean for today? That means I'm going to be blindfolded and I'm going to do her makeup. We'll see how it goes. Um, we haven't really chosen a look. I don't think there's a whole lot of point in doing that because, I mean, let's be real, it's probably gonna be pretty busted. But uh, I'm gonna try and make it work. I am hoping that at the end of this, she'll look somewhat good. And I'm going to insert a picture here of a time I did her makeup and it looked beautiful. Just to let you know that I am a capable artist when the time calls for it and I can actually use my, my senses. So we have everything laid out here. And I have a mirror in front of Jade so she can see how good or bad it's going. She's not going to give me any direction even if I ask for it. And it's going to be a surprise for me too at the end <laughs> to see how this goes. Okay, so I can see a little so I'm going to fold this over once. Does that look okay? <laughs> Just like in the movie. All right, we're Jake, can you hand me the uh, moisturizer? <laughs> Am I supposed to help? Yeah, you? this is what I'm, I'm just can't find it. <laughs> it feels like a lot. Much <laughs> <laughs> worse than I thought it would be. Is that your face? Yeah. <laughs> and the the kicker to this is that when me and Jade are done, we're going to a nice dinner <laughs> that we have a reservation for <laughs> at seven o'clock. So let's hope. That this is not as bad as it is starting off. <laughs> that may come out. Yep. Okay. This is really hard. This would have been even harder if I was blindfolded too. Yes. Like they were outside, right? You know, I have a confession to make. I haven't seen the movie. <laughs> hey, I watched it begrudgingly. Uh huh. Um, In preparation for this? No, because okay. everyone was talking about it and yes. I wanted to know what they were talking about. Okay. Um, but I didn't really like it. You didn't like it? Mm -mm. So give me the basic rundown with no spoilers. Um, every time they go outside, they have to be blindfolded. Why though? Because there's like an entity that okay. when you see it, it like forces you, like your mind, well, normal people would like lose their mind and like step in front of like buses and trains so or like jump out windows or, but like people that were say like already, maybe people that have been like in jail or they were like, I don't know if mentally disturbed is the right word, but anyways, just crazy people already. They saw something beautiful, so it just kind of depended on, I guess, your mental state. And I kept waiting for something to happen. And then like all of a sudden it was over. Oh. Yeah, and I thought it was gonna be scary and it, it wasn't scary at all. Oh, is this concealer? Yes. <laughs> I'm scared. Yeah, I'm scared. I'm pretty sure I have translucent powder here. Uh -huh. I'm not really sure what I'm setting, <laughs> but I'm going to try to bake under her eyes and uh, and then dust the rest of her face, I guess. It, like me and Jade are friends from high school even. Mm -hmm. So it, we go back. Even before my formal makeup training, I was doing her makeup. That's true. Although she's really good at doing her own makeup too, so she's like, doesn't need my help as much as other friends of ours. Like Erica. <laughs> <laughs> Erica, no, she's Erica the first person to say it. That. Yeah. This is awful. I'm so sorry. I have no idea what I'm I don't know that I can go out like this afterwards. Is it that bad already? I don't know. I can't tell you. <laughs> What's your like one thing you can't leave the house without? Oh, mascara. Oh no, maybe that's why. Eyebrows. I feel like my eyebrows are like, now that I'm so used to filling them in, yeah. I feel like that's the first thing people notice if I'm not wearing my eyebrows. Meanwhile, there was like two days I went to work without them and people didn't even notice. <laughs> but you know, if you're not wearing mascara, people are like, oh, are you tired, dear? <laughs> no, but thank you for noticing. <laughs> if I have to like get presentable fast, I'll just do lipstick. Oh, okay. I just want to let you guys know that I actually have not opened my eyes this entire time. Like not even to like try to peek. 
So I'm like actually using things from memory or at least trying. And this is a brand new palette. I was gonna say that looks pretty fresh. Yeah, it's a, it's a freshie and I'm not too familiar with it yet, but I am 44% sure that this bottom color is a blush, so I'm gonna try it. But I could be opening it upside down too, which is the scary part. Well, either way, they're all pretty. Yep. <laughs> Brave, let me do this to you. I know, I just must deeply trust you. <laughs> I can't wait till you try and put on my eyebrows or like lipstick. You're gonna like stick it in my nose or something. <laughs> now, highlighter, but you know, highlighter, right. even if you put it everywhere, it still looks good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Who's your favorite drag queen from RuPaul's Drag Race? Mm -hmm. Probably Adore Delano because it's one of the only ones I follow on Instagram. I love, I actually have never seen his season, but really? I love Aquarius. Oh. Love, I just love everything he does. I just also want to let you guys know that if I'm like looking down at things and then like looking up, it is literally just force of habit. I cannot see. It's probably really frustrating every time you look down and can't see anything. Yep. I'm closing my eyes too, because like the hat is a bit see-through. Like I folded it over twice to try and help, but. All right. So we're gonna go in with the palette that we both like. Yay! From a brand we both like. This is the new Sultry palette. We pre-picked this stuff because me trying to pick blindfolded and apply blindfolded just seemed like a nightmare. You know, I just realized like the bad thing about choosing this palette is I've only used it once, so I have no idea which colors are which. <laughs> um, okay. But I remember as a rule, the Anastasia Beverly Hills palettes usually start light and get darker. So let's just try the furthest top left shade. I strongly considered doing one half of her makeup first. I was, I think this is better probably or worse maybe. <laughs> this uh, is terrible, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I mean, it could be worse. Um, I'd like to know how. Uh, Are you just being nice? Well, yeah, I'm waiting till you get to the eyeliner. That's gonna be pretty shitty. <laughs> I might skip <laughs> eyeliner. <laughs> I mean, maybe for like the sake of my vision. And just go with that one. So this was the first one, and this is the second color she has now. That's right. That one. That's your eye. It is my eye. I gotta admit at this point, like mm -hmm. I am still trying, mm -hmm. but I have kind of, it is so much harder than I thought it would be. I've kind of given up hope of it being good. I mean, it might be okay. Imagine if it turned out great and that you could just call it like intuitive makeup or something. I didn't count. I should have counted on, I didn't count those. The counting won't help. Yeah. That was the one. It is? Yeah. Okay, so now I'm gonna try and find a metallic shade to, to I don't know. I don't even know why, <laughs> but I'm gonna try. I feel like this one's a metallic. This one feels a little more bumpy. Okay. I have no idea where that color was again, so that's fine. This is fine. I'm so scared. I'm scared too, that's why I'm not talking or breathing. <laughs> okay, I changed my mind. I'm gonna give her a fake mole. <laughs> That'll be... There we go. Perfect. Who is this, Claudia Schiffer and Madonna? It is now. Mm-hmm. Mascara. Can you find me mascara? Here we go. This is scary too. <laughs> Just keep your eyes closed, how about? Okay. <laughs> that's my face. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> this is where the cheer disaster comes in, I feel. They're not as sparse as I thought they were. Okay, so we've learned something today before I even see this. And that is that I thought I could do this there's been times when you're doing like 10 wedding party members in a row and you're like, I could do this in my sleep. I was wrong. <laughs> I rely 99% on sight. 
<laughs> and then the other one percent is muscle memory. Yeah, maybe. Have you looked at yourself? Oh yeah. <laughs> you don't look at the camera and give them a number from one to ten. How well you think I'm doing? Okay. Do you remember that video you did where Sienna does your makeup? Yeah. It's <laughs> she told me she wants. She like fills in her brows pretty solidly, so she told me she wants me to teach her how to like feather them. So I'm gonna do that right now. Mm. <laughs> Imagine you like draw me a unibrow. <laughs> do you know how hard I work to not have a unibrow? <laughs> I can't even tell where your brows are. Have you seen the movie Coco? <laughs> <laughs> where are you going with this? <laughs> Is this the lipstick? Yes. Took me took me a minute. <laughs> you made a big mess too. I did? <laughs> well, here. Oh. Yeah, on your table. <laughs> I'm gonna advise you just keep your lips together. Mm -hmm. <laughs> here we go. done all the steps except for setting spray. Do you want to set this? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> Did it get you? Last time, have a look at yourself. Don't tell me, but show the viewers on a scale of 1 to 10 on your hands how well you think I did. And then I'll tell you how I think you did. Or well, I guess I'll tell you how I think I did. And we'll see how close we are. Okay. Ready? Mm-hmm. <laughs> I waxed my eyebrows for many years to not look like this. I picked like all light colors somehow for the eyes. We're not gonna talk about the lipstick. <laughs> Foundation, bit patchy, but not too bad. Mm -hmm. You're, are you crying? Well, I'm gonna give it a two. That's what I gave you. Oh, well. We're so, so we're still insane. friends? Yeah, we're still friends. Yay. I just need a makeup wipe. Oh, <laughs> you sure do. If you're feeling brave, if well, if your friend is feeling brave, uh, probably a good idea to follow in our footsteps and give this a shot. Give yourself enough time to wash it off before you go out. But thanks for coming back and I'll see you guys on the next one.